what's up guys welcome back to another video this is a taco diving episode and i got some clips from the last two dives that i went on before we get into it i just want to let you guys know that this video is sponsored by the dar division of aquatic resources they wanted me to let you guys know that they are hosting these meetings called holomua talk sessions there's going to be three of them and the events will be held live on maui they'll mostly be going over a bunch of changes to the rules and regulations that we have today I highly suggest participating as they are trying to get the community involved and it's important for us fishermen to get our voice and opinions heard. Here are the meeting dates and locations. They will also be in the description down below as well as the registration link. Mahalo for your attention and let's get on with the video. Alright, here we go. Just got into the water and in less than 10 minutes I found the first taco of the day. As you guys can see, it's pretty shallow. I'm diving on the flats. Plus, it's low tide. I don't think the tide has anything to do with how good the taco diving is. Sometimes you find tacos super deep, and sometimes they're in very, very shallow water. This water was like three feet deep, super shallow, but comfort wise, it's not the best. It was kind of hard swimming today, but. So here's the second taco hole I found. I saw the hole first and then I was looking for the taco and I realized it was right there, all camouflaged. And as I got closer, it changed the color to the dark brown ruby color. Poked this guy out and I realized he was super small so catch and release. The next hole I found was a nice hole, but nobody was home. Just a sea urchin in there. The next taco I found was pretty blown out. He wasn't that blended in with his environment. He was pretty orange. He didn't really have any rocks by his hole either. I saw this next hole from very far away and I didn't even know if there was a taco in there yet but I was pointing at the hole and as I slowly swam around to it, there he was. Here's the next taco I found. I tried to get a close up of this taco. I put the GoPro pretty much in its hole. And boom, <laughs> he blew the camera out the hole. He did not like that. Just poke him out and he came out really easily. As I was swimming, I came across a pile of rocks and I didn't see no taco, but something looked off and I decided to investigate. I took some rocks out of the hole and of course, there was a taco in there. 
Sometimes the tacos will cover their hole with rocks, especially at night. This hole was kind of weird, it was like in a crack of the reef. So getting them out was pretty tough. I was going at it for around five minutes. And the taco would just stay in the hole or find a crevice in the hole where I couldn't reach. So it was pretty tough, but I eventually got them out. All right, and that was the end of that dive. This was a new dive, and this was the first taco I saw, and this was a cool one because when I put the camera close to its hole, it brought in the rocks and used it almost as a door. And as I got pushed back from the current, I couldn't see the taco anymore. It was very hidden. I'm wondering if I passed this taco hole and it looked like that, if I would've even saw it. I took some rocks out and started poking. And once he starts coming out, you can already get ready to grab him. Not far from that toggle hole, I spotted another one. And I noticed the toggle was sitting right on top of the hole, all camouflaged. Can you see it? As I swam further, it slinked right down its hole and turned all ruby. Now this hole was very obvious and I got very excited thinking this was a huge taco because if you can see there's all the sand sprayed out of the hole and I went up close and I realized ah it's the same old average two pounder but the hole was super cool. Here's the last hole to dive. This wasn't even really a taco hole. I just saw the taco slink into this crevice and start poking them out. Start coming out really easily and yeah. I think this was actually the biggest one right here. This was when I was I was just swimming in. I didn't even I wasn't even looking anymore. But yeah. Great way to end the video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Mahalo.